What up, homies? Today is gonna be an exciting day. I have another studio vlog for you today. I got an order for 50 of my coffee candles called Brute Awakening, so we'll be making those together. I actually started this video yesterday, so you're gonna see a little like clips of me in a different shirt, and it's because I started working on the order, I opened up the bag of wicks, and then realized I didn't have enough wicks to fulfill the order, so I had an hour and like 10 minutes before Candle Science closed for pickup. I live an hour away, placed the order, ran to my car, drove to Candle Science, and when I got there, my order wasn't ready, and so, I was like, please, 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 just make one exception, please. And they actually did it. So shout out to Candle Science. Love you guys. Tons, tons, tons. And then I got back and I did some prep work yesterday. So yesterday I prepared the um, candles that I need to make today. I put the wicks in and now my wax is warm and we're going to make them and we got to do our whip because they're dessert candles. And we're just going to hang out like buddies and do that together. Next up. Tomorrow night, which is Sunday, August 13th at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, I'm launching fall wax melts. So wax melts in cinnamon buns, fallen leaves, snickerdoodle cookies, pumpkin spice, and banana bread are launching tomorrow, and fall car fresheners are already available. So that's so exciting. Candles are gonna be coming for the fall very soon, but all right, enough chit chat. Let's go ahead and make some stuff because it is getting late. After I finished my mission to candle science, when I got home, I started prepping my jars. So I peeled off the wick sticker and then placed the wicks on there. This is actually not my favorite thing to do. It's actually my least favorite part of candle making because it just takes so much time. So here I am preparing all the jars. Every time I make candles, well, I try to make content so I'll prop my phone up so that I'll have content throughout the week because sometimes I just don't know what to post online. So here I am making a batch. I'm just making the batches for the bases and for the whip because I'm starting to cool the whip actually the same time that I make the bases and just pour them one by one. And this is a lot faster than it actually happens. And I cut the parts out when I was transferring out the wax to put it in the funnel. But I really love this device. It's actually a chocolate funnel. It helps so that I don't have a lot of cleanup to do on the jars. I hate when like the wax splatters everywhere. And this really does minimize that. While we're waiting for the wax for the whip to cool, let's clean up a little bit, tidy up because it's a mess. I still have to do product descriptions and stuff for the site for my launch tomorrow, and I haven't done that yet, but I might do that off camera. Yeah, let's tidy up. Oh, let me show you this. So yesterday I went live on TikTok, and someone was like, can you color the inside of the car fresheners? And I was like, huh, I never tried that, but I can try it using some mica. So the thing is, it like settles to the bottom, as you can see, but I'm gonna shake it real quick to show you what it looks like. Wah, 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 wah. So cool. If it would stay like this, I would introduce it in the shop, but I don't like how that settles like that. But this is a little burner car freshie that I have for myself. Mine just, um, mine just finished in my car, but this is a uh, fallen leaves. Also for fall, I did a few more, I'm gonna show you. So this is caramel popcorn, snickerdoodle cookies, campfire marshmallow. 
These are eight bucks in the shop, not bad. If you wanna check it out, I'll leave a link to my online store in the shop description. I got wax on my shirt. I totally forgot that I was recording a YouTube video. So the whip finished and I had just went to go get lunch and I was thinking that it was gonna take a while, but it finished. So I did not yet get a chance to clean and I was all set up to go live on TikTok and I forgot that I was recording and I was like, damn, let me grab my camera. So um, we're gonna go live on TikTok and whip these and then after that we'll clean i have to do some stuff on my computer to get ready for this launch tomorrow i know i don't know why i'm like this i don't know but i always get it done so let's do that so at this point i am live on tiktok i was live on tiktok probably for a nice little 45 minutes the trolls got me on there i don't know what it's was up with like teenagers on tiktok and why they love to troll small businesses but i just be on there playing dumb when they try to do that kind of stuff with me <laughs> i'd be like uh i don't know what you're talking about i'm so sorry mm -hmm. all right and this is what the batch looks like so this is the brood awakening candle at skylight it smells like hazelnut coffee it has notes of maple and cream here's a close-up so that is the top of the candle it is so freaking cute and the label has little um coffees all over it that was 2017 all good chuck a look around find one to see my type damn my dog and he know what i like he done found me plenty in my life problem is i meet a girl tonight then i go and treat it too nice. i don't know but i just have this thing where i think that i can get done a lot more than i like do sometimes so i'm very happy i made the 50 candles i needed to for this order i did not get a chance to trim the wicks add the labels or clean the jars that's it's like it takes a little time but it's pretty quick so i'll probably do that in the morning and i still have another um large order to fulfill so i'll probably do that tomorrow too but i'm not sure if i'll record that i feel like i've been hitting y'all a little hard with the studio vlogs lately but let me know if you enjoy this type of content by hitting the like button and commenting down below i'm still kind of trying to find my groove here but i have some fantastic videos i plan on doing um i'm doing a bathroom renovation probably show you guys my garden things like that and also of course a lot of flight training so i I've been doing that a lot lately like just flying a lot and um if you want to see more of that make sure you hit the subscribe button but until next time i appreciate you guys hanging today and i'll see you in the next one